Hey yo, welcome back to my channel. We are playing another game of Spotful Training. This time we're doing levels 5 and 6, so let's just get straight into it. First we have Uka Target Practice. You have to hit the targets like usual, but you also have to make sure you don't hit the birds. Now, true, the music may be a bit unsettling, but the landscape is pretty nice for Wii game. Two, three, four, oh, oh, company is such early. And, oh, that, mm, I think the birds take so much score. Wait, why did the birds move right? Why did the bird drop right there? Okay, so, got another. Okay, now, there are two items. There's more. Doing pretty good. Got him, got him. Oh, just fine. Alright. Got it. Wait, there's another bird. Wait, why did it? Aye. Okay. This part. I'm being dead. One, two, three. I guess I can. Two, three. And oh, come on. Oh, just last second. Alright. So how how this works is I have to get 80,000 score. And that 5,000 doesn't really help that much. I got a defender level. So this one is alright, so we got these leeches. Skulls first. Oh, those steal much more score. I don't even need to hit the skulls. So. Two, three. Well, that score stacks up fast. Here we have hit any. There we go. Just again. All right. And now we got these spinning things surrounding me. Oh, it's already over. Wow. Eesh. I don't think I'm getting eighty thousand on the first try like last time. There are 25 enemies in total, and it seems there are a lot of them that wield bows, because they're all up high. Yeah, that's a bit dramatic. Even though I shot almost all of them, there were 7 enemies that I couldn't find. See, and- wait, there's a guy- what? Am I supposed to prevent that? How am I supposed to prevent that? And I only got 26,000, giving me the lowest medal of them. Okay, let's see if level 6 is any easier. Board on target practice, number 2. Alright, so it's kind of a carousel thing. Just saving you the trouble I did not do on that one. Alright, to stage two, it is the Bridge of Elden Defender. Which, this one is pretty fun! You just have to shoot enemies while you're riding the horse. Or, I think it's a carriage of some sort. So you have to shoot them while they escort. You have to escort them, you have to shoot all these enemies. It's pretty fun, honestly. The difficulty of it is pretty high to get a good school. Be really accurate because if you shoot the driver, it veers off the horse and it's very, very easily that the pigs can be used to build up some combo to get some extra score pretty fast. So as long as you keep that streak going. Poor pigs, just keep murdering him up. Right. And they all ran into that. That's fun. 
Ooh, not a terrible score, but I'm not sure how I'm going to get 80,000 with that. Alright. At least we got the uh, bronze medal. This one is a ranger one where you have to just run around and shoot things. There's somebody trying to kill me. Got these chill post guys and they throw spears at me. Wait, I didn't die instantly. He still has his uh, weapon so he can deflect the bullets. Ah, uh, makes sense. So that's here. Got him. Oh, seriously, I missed that? And why did he just do the Tootsie Slide? <laughs> Any more enemies out here? And. Yep. And I got hit. Yeah, it's kind of obvious. Yeah, those. I'm gonna be using bomb hairs a lot now. Makes quick work of them. Well, I can use that and get a good score out of that. I didn't find any other enemies until I went around the corner and I somehow missed that bomb shot. There's just a whole bunch of enemies. I didn't necessarily know what to do in this area, so I just decided to keep bombing them. And then I noticed the time. 10 seconds left and 12 enemies left. So I decided to do what any sane person would do and shoot continuously as fast as I can. Did that help? No. 5,000 score, and only a bronze medal. So let's do it well. I'm gonna stay to the trouble with this one, and I did not do really well. But I did find if you shoot all the floating things, you get a fairy, which does a really good job helping cut that score. I got pretty accurate, and when it came to it, it did pretty well. I'm going to do a good job on this one and end up getting over 13,000 score. So this isn't the winning run for this, but at least I did well. In the one I did complete 80,000, I got 11,000 for that stage, but it's good. Stage 2, I learned very easily that it's not about shooting them as fast as you can, it's about the combos. Just shooting 10 correctly can give you thousands of score. And this can increase your score for this level by a large margin. So as long as you don't miss any, you're going to get a huge score. Nice. Wait, <laughs> now we just ran down the mountain. God. There's no way I could have gotten those at the same exact time. Alright, got you. These guys surrounding me again. Ooh, this is a large combo. 30 combo. Ooh, and we got a good, nice score jump. Let's see how many of these I can shoot. I think these give me like 3k each. But oh well. 54,000 is really good. And only less than 15,000 away. I just need to get 15,000 score, and I'm at. 80,000. Now, for the shootout one, it did take me a few tries, but I was able to find all of them. Got one here, one here. There's only a few of them that actually walk on the ground. Yeah, this guy decided to hide from me. Not like it's going to do much for him. Shoot them before they even see me. It's the best way to do it. Somehow, I didn't miss that shot. Yeah, so shoot him before he sees me. Now, you did hear crystal fall, but I just thought it's easier to hit him without the crystal. These guys are sh hiding in here like a shooting gallery. Hiding in here like a shooting gallery. Pretty stupid if you ask me. It took me a while to find those guys. And now we have this... With a few more enemies. This guy had an early aim on me, but completely failed to kill me. Got these guys here, and a really good streak here. Let's see, just blow up those for fun. Got this guy here. Now, if I back up, 
I can see that little... Mm, got him. Alright, and now it's just one guy left. Let's go with that. Oh, so high. Explosion victory! Let's go! Alright. 48,000. Wait, I only needed like 15,000. Oh, that's a really high score. Really high score. Alright. And that's platinum for level 5. Now we can go to level 6. Hold on, practice number 2. Alright, so this one was a bit more difficult than the other one. The, uh, voodoo one. Basically, it's just like the other one. You have to make sure you do not hit any of the bad targets and make sure you hit all the good ones. That one was a tight squeeze, but I was able to make it. I kept hitting the X ones, which made it impossible to get the triangle bonus. But this round, I did really well. Didn't hit any of them. And getting a really high combo here getting like 30 almost 30 and reaching almost hitting 30 but i got a really good score i also found out that that thing gives you a fairy which gives you more score and i got stung by those wasps over there so i got revenge getting an extra score and getting that combo even higher and getting that bonus so Starting off a really strong 23,000 to 80,000. This next one, the Bridge of Elden, it really doesn't have much to it. Just have to make sure you hit every single guy in a successive order. And I also learned that you have to hit the archers first before the drivers or else they go wee 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 and you can't catch the piggy. So, if you hit far off ones, it's easier because you have a smaller range of error. And since this crossbow does not have any spread, it makes it easier to do that. For some reason, I wasn't able to hit that big, but that one was pretty easy to hit. Just keeping going with that streak, which I kept losing miserably. Getting that streak, and keep keeping it up with the pig shot I found earlier. So making sure to get that thing in the back because I just couldn't keep my streak. But still, despite I kept losing my streak, I was doing some really good moves and getting a lot of score. With another 27,000 to fill in the margin between my score and 80,000. So for this one, I only had to get 30,000. Uh, side note, I'm going to show you another gameplay that I had here. It was of another round I did, just showing that I know where every single other Chilfos is. There was those two up top I didn't notice earlier. So found out the power of multiplicative score. So I had to make sure they didn't throw their spears. If I did, I could get extra combo. And by the time I broke them, I would be getting a lot of score. So just hitting it like that, I got 2,800 for one. That gave me over 3,000. So the multiplicative hitting gives me extra score. The issue is, is it's not too effective and you end up missing a whole bunch of the score. So the enemies taking away from your final bonus. This is not the final round I played that gave me it, but using the multiplicative scoring, I got 53,000, getting a gold one, a gold medal, which isn't, it was very close to platinum, but I need to do better on the other ones, so. Just going back to the one that I did get the platinum medal, just making sure I apply that multiplicative scoring with a bit of speed so that I didn't run out of time and not hit all the enemies. Now the bats suck as usual, so it took me a little bit to knock them out. And so, making sure that they didn't see me before I hit them, I knocked those guys out, made sure I could get those guys. 
just getting him real fast. I kept missing my hits, so I probably could have gotten a much higher score, but I messed up on that. I also found out that you can blow up these ice walls, so I did that and got hit, which wasn't the intention for doing that, but oh well. Alright, so got that guy. And doing that really well, getting a good multiple kit of scoring, and with enough time to get all of them. These guys decided to throw theirs early, so I just decided to wipe them out early. Yep, it's up turn. So those guys just hiding, can get them. And so I only have four enemies left. The one on top, which I got hit by him. This guy here, which I just hit him, five seconds left on the clock, and I found the rest of them. And got that nice little bonus as a cherry on top. Not as high as that 53,000 I got earlier, but it was enough to get me to 92,000, which was the target score for Platinum Metal. Now with only three levels left and the Link's Crossbow Training Series, I will see you guys next time. I'll be streaming the final uh, probably next week. So thanks for watching, and see you next time.